This is Dr. Susan Thrall. I'm going to show you how to do a make table query. When you do a make table query, the first thing you need to do is to test and run your query before you do the make table part. So here we are in query design view. I have my field list up here and on my query grid I have chosen several of the fields to display. Under customer type, I've chosen government. So I want to make a table that just has the government customers in it. But before I do that, I want to make sure that that's all I have when I run the simple query using government as the criterion. So I type government in the criteria box, run the query, and see that indeed I do have the three government customers. So this is what I want to make a table of. But you should always make sure the query runs before you make a table and waste your time. So going back to design view, I know my criteria runs correctly. So now I'm going to choose the query type that says make table. When I choose make table, the dialog box opens up and I can type in a name which I already have which is going to be table government customer. I want to append this to my current database as opposed to another database. I click OK and it seems as if nothing happens. Here you have to remember the step that you actually have to run the query again. It doesn't work. You can't make the table unless you run it. So I'm going to run it and up comes, it says, you're about to paste three rows into a new table. Once you click yes, you can't undo it other than erasing the table. So I'm going to click yes. And again, it looks like nothing has happened. But when I open my navigation pane, I can see that right here, I have table government customer, a new table, which I can double click, open up in data sheet view, and there indeed is my new table that I created from my query.